Imagine going on stage and you're talking, but all the audience only hear this. Well, today we're gonna talk about how to speak clearly and enunciate well. Let's dive into it. I have been studying and doing public speaking for five years. I help millennials look and sound like an authority when they do their presentations. I started out not speaking very well as a child. I was more of a visual learner. And making it worse is my parents' job. They were assigned in various countries around the world and they dragged me with them. And I needed to learn language and how to speak well fast. There's no excuse. If I don't learn the language, I'm not going to be accepted in any school. At least any local school and going for international schools was very very expensive so that's why I forced myself to learn Italian and this pattern was coming up again and again and again I moved to one country I need to learn the language I need to speak well and the thing is I need to speak clear and enunciate well or else people of the locals won't even understand me I won't be able to buy my cereals and that is very crucial when you're a kid and milk and throughout these years I learned that there's a pattern on how you can speak clearly and enunciate well. I learned it while going to one country to another and learning the process again and again of learning new languages. So that's why I'm gonna share you my secrets that I've learned in those years of going in the country, learning the language and how to pronounce it properly and speak clearly because you will need this not only in this language in English but also Italian and any other languages you're, that you're about to learn. And when you learn this one thing, this one skill of how to enunciate and speak clearly, it's gonna change your communication skills forever. And everyone is gonna say, Whoa! Whoa! And you like to get those, Whoa! Speak slowly and steadily. If you speak too fast, then you're gonna go super fast that no one's gonna understand you, but only you. You'll be, you'll be able to understand yourself, but not super duper others. Yeah, you see what I did there? I speak way too fast. If I speak way too fast and not steadily, you will not understand what point I'm trying to give to you. So, do not rush it. Speak slowly and steadily. But don't be like a snail when you speak or else everyone is going to sleep. Go through consonants and vowels exercise so you can learn how to speak well. These are very important if you want to warm up your voice and also able to sound clear to others. I'll be referencing down below a link where you can see all of this reference from wikihow. It's free. Ba be bi bo bu ba be vi bo bu You can see the link in the description or I'm just gonna put a card here so you can take action. Practice tongue twisters. Practicing tongue twisters will help you enunciate far more better in your speaking skills. Here's an example, one of my favorites. Whether the weather is cold or whether the weather is hot, we'll be together, whatever weather, whether we like it or not. I repeat that for 10 times and it's awesome. It's a reference from High Status book. This is the link to it. I'm not affiliated. I wish I was, but I'm not. Record yourself when speaking. What you do not see, you do not appreciate. No, what you don't see and hear something that you don't give importance out of mind out of sight out of sight out of mind so if you can't see the problem you're not going to be able to solve it so what i recommend is you when you go and speak you record yourself or if you don't do public speaking engagements like i do i recommend getting a book reading a paragraph loud you can just use your phone to record the audio so you can see where you're stumbling at or what you're or where you need to improve by recording yourself you're trying consciously to see the, what is the problem, to see what are the consonants or the vowels, the ah, ee, uh, what is the problem. You're going to see them when you record yourself. So record yourself. Practice with an object in your mouth. This is very helpful. So let's see. I don't have anything right now at the moment, but you can see what I got this at the moment. Put something in your mouth. Let's start reading. Like, Hello, what is that? That's very exciting and very playful to do. But doing this is very helpful. So go and get your book from the other exercise and start reading with something in your mouth after, after you have done that exercise. This is going to be very helpful because it's like a muscle. If you can do 50 pounds barbell curls, and that, then you can basically lift anything 
or even 100 pounds but this is like doing the same thing you're putting something in your mouth so you can strain the muscles and you can basically speak stronger and clearly if you can do if you can speak clearly like this then you can speak clearly without this thing in your mouth so put something in your mouth and then start speaking just do it a couple of times like a couple of minutes don't overdo it because if you're overdo it uh, you might damage your vocal cords and i don't want to get liable for that <laughs> so this is not a medical recommendation but only a tip so you can start sounding more clear speak loudly and clearly so this is basically just an example you go up and you read your book get any book or flyer whatever you have there lying around you even your notebook with your uh, secrets just don't tell everyone just speak loud you can go and get your diary and start speaking it that's gonna really make you learn some stuff about yourself basically get a notebook or a book and you start reading loud as loud as you can record yourself speaking blah 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 you just go and read something like a paragraph as loud as you can because if you can do this you will train your mind on how you can sound more clearly while upping the volume and you can really start to focus on the things that you need to improve what consonant and vowels you need to improve so go and speak loud just don't destroy your eardrums please also your neighbors ones okay so go be cautious about it next is stand straight Stand up for your right. This will help you get up, stand up, breathe more air. And when you have more air, you can speak with stronger and clearer voice. So I basically recommend you do that. Shoulders back and down. Inhale with your nose and go and talk. This will give you more resonance and more power on your voice. <laughs> this area here, your mouth and your neck will have more power and you'll be able to access your diaphragm which is very important because that helps you sound much more resonant and speak more clearly don't overdo it don't be like i'm standing straight so please don't overdo it next observe yourself speak in front of the mirror while you see your facial expressions this is very important because when you're speaking in public like now i'm speaking here blah, 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 blah. i speak i don't see my freaking facial muscles but if you if you blah, blah, blah. but if you speak in front of the mirror you will see so what the facial muscles aren't you really moving what do you need to warm up in your face you'll see that by doing and speaking in front of the mirror dramatize your words this is very important because if you don't dramatize <gasps> Give me the donut or the chip or I'll save America and call Donald Trump. This is for America. Start doing dramatizing anything from getting coffee from saying Donald Trump or make America great again. Make the Philippines great again. You can basically dramatize every sound, every word that comes up from your beautiful mouth. Because if you do this, you engage your mouth, vocal cords and you know how to pronounce properly and this will transpire and will prove your pronunciation making your voice clearer and you can enunciate well okay this okay read aloud one page every morning as loud as you can this is similar to the book exercise we're reading one paragraph but now we're trying to make it a habit waking up and speaking loud just one page not 10 pages not 20 but only one page it could be a small book a big book just get a book and start speaking loud you will notice what are your weaknesses on speaking so remember that <laughs>